Well, welcome to uh, Singapore and uh, welcome to the uh, Park Royal Hotel Pickering. Going through our staycations through uh, coronavirus times. Down to uh, number five, I think, after the uh, raffles for seasons, MBS. Capella's is uh, Park Royal on Pickering. Got a nice uh, urban uh, suite up there with some nice views. That's the place. 16 floors. Uh, the best bit, or one of the good bits, is the on level five. Got like a garden and pool. See all those gardens. It's themed on the uh, the rice paddy fields of uh, Bali. Rice paddy fields about where we would probably otherwise be were it not for coronavirus. All right. Walk you in through uh, Honlin Park, the hotel up there. Uh, the three-day, two-night staycation. It's Honlin Park. You can see the uh, the CBD of Singapore in the distance. Uh, hotel is between Chinatown and the CBD. The CBD is over there. And uh, this is uh, Honlin Park Hotel. Uh, Singapore Speakers Corner, which is uh, a bit like Hyde Park in London, I think. Uh, is also just here. It's the Speakers Corner here. And uh, yeah, it's the hotel. We've got a lovely, uh, hot, sunny day here in uh, SG. Just walk you over. So basically the CBD is to the left, just in that direction. See uh, skyscrapers there. Hotel is a convenient location. Its impact is uh, they have shows and stuff there. Swiss Hotel Merchant Court is uh, just over there. That's on the uh, Clarkey area. There's your hotel. Ready, walk through the gardens, across the street, and uh, up to the front. Ready, so welcome to SG, hot sunny day, dripping with sweat. Uh, Park Royal Pickering it is. Uh, many of you have asked uh, for me to stay here and uh, do a review. So uh, here we have it, alright. Yeah, so you see the gardens and on various floors. You can only access the gardens on level 5. Got an infinity swimming pool there. Sort of themed on the rice paddy fields of Bali. Think back to the Ritz Carlton Mandapa. And I had a hilltop uh, in the lobby. Yeah, that's the place. We've got cabanas and stuff. Uh, see the cabanas there? There's a pool there. Yeah, we'll get in there. Alright, we'll walk uh, to the street. Yeah, Hunlin Park. We we'll have to wait to cross if there's a red light. It's a working day in uh, Singapore. It's a working day in Singapore. Cars are just moving, so we should uh, hit the next green man. It's a working day in Singapore. It's like 3.30 in the afternoon, so there's uh, stuff going on. Uh, i got half a day off, so uh, I'll stay in the hotel, right? Uh, so the CBD is straight ahead. That's the Park Royal Collection. Two time. There's the gardens I was talking about. It's a bit of light here, not so bright. All right, take a slow walk down and then we won't have to cut the camera. You see the skyscrapers in the distance? It's a Raffles place. It's up there. So there's four towers there. Alright, Green Man. Alright, Green Man, let's get across. Looks uh, irresponsible if you film across the street at the same time. So it's the, ho it's the hotel here now. Lime is there, restaurant and bar. Park Royal Collection. This is a uh, Chinatown just, just over here. Chinatown is uh, just over here. To the uh, Chinatown subway station. It's 
there's Chinatown on there. Upper Hokkien Street. Where's the stop there? Up Royal. Uh, everybody on the social media has said this place is great. So I uh, decided to stay here. I was either here on the Manning Oriental or the W at Sentosa. I was uh, working down my own list. It's either Manning Oriental or W at Sentosa. But a lot of you have said uh, this place is great. So uh, yeah, I can't stay here. Why not? We're lucky with the green man. Straight here through the trees, you can see the Swiss Hotel Stamford. So Pickering Street, the Upper Pickering Street is the name of the road. Just walk you along here. See the building and the gardens. Yeah, so it's themed as a hotel in a garden. Bali Ubud by that. Get past this guy cleaning the uh, water out. Yeah, that's the restaurant. We're going there for breakfast. Yeah, themed as a hotel in a garden. Singapore is the garden city. It's also one of the nine architectural wonders in Singapore. One of the nine architectural wonders along with like MBS, Esplanade, National Gallery, a few other places. Not sure if Gardens by the Bay is one. Good place. It opened 2013 or 2009, 2009, something like that. It won lots of awards for architectural design. I climbed the restaurant, we're going there for uh, breakfast. It says impact it's so. The lobby area. Where the lobby bar is. All the seats and the waterfall. Nice, isn't it? It's nice on a hot day, yeah, just standing here in the cool uh, with the water to cool you down. So, there's four towers with this building. The first three is the hotel, the fourth one is the Attorney General's Chamber. So I'm not going to walk all that far back. I'm not sure if you're on the video outside it. So uh, let's see. Attorney General's chamber straight ahead. Hotel is the first three blocks. So uh, let's see you inside. All right, just, uh, take the camera around and uh, we'll see you inside. This place, Park Royal Pickering. Ready. Attorney General's chamber straight ahead. Hotel uh, just to my left. So I'll see you in the lobby and I'll take you out to my uh, urban junior suite. All right, enjoy. The entrance in. Chinatown just over there. So I'll uh, walk you into the lobby. I'll uh, walk you into the uh, the lobby. So, yeah, the main entrance in.
Yeah, if all this uh, scan your phone stuff, uh, the coronavirus. Ready, walk in. Still over here. That's where the uh, the bar was. Lobby bar. for the uh, the lobby bar the bar has been moved to lime now so uh there isn't a lobby bar there anymore it's checking and stuff straight ahead oh, nice here. see the uh, the water feature outside Nice, yeah. The restaurant is uh, just through here. It's the water feature again. Let's let that guy go past. Sees me taking a photo, he does it himself. All right, that's life. That happens quite a lot actually, yeah. Uh, somebody sees you taking a photo and they do it themselves. I think you must have seen something amazing. That's all of the experience that on your travels. Right, it's Lime the restaurant. So I've got a club room on the top floor, level 16. Uh, five is where the gardens and so on are. Garden pool, the fitness uh, fitness center, the spa, St. Gregory Spa. I'm on the top floor, right, we'll see upstairs. Nice lime. Now for breakfast. See upstairs. There's the lifts. So, uh, welcome up to my uh, floor at uh, Park Royal Pickering. I'm on uh, level 10 in a, it's a lift lobby. I'm on level 10 in a uh, Junior suite, it's a club uh, junior suite, uh, just to the left room, uh, 1038. Uh, I'll show you the view on the right side because uh, you can just see Singapore's uh, highest building. You see uh, Singapore's highest building on uh, the side. I'm on the other side, uh, there's the corridors here, there is a water feature on the place. So Singapore's highest building is the, uh, that building just there, which you can see between the trees, uh, if I'm not mistaken, correct me if I'm wrong. Pretty sure that's uh, Singapore's highest building. 90 meters. Yeah. Looking uh, southwards towards the port, over port area. It's the corridors uh, here at uh, Park Royal. Nice uh, water features. Alrighty, I'm on uh, this side. So I'm on this side in a junior suite uh, just to walk you over. That's the lift lobby. It's the lift lobby up, uh, make uh, full use of the place. The way the hotel is structured is that uh, it's basically the lobby on the ground floor. Level five has all the, it's the wellness center, which has got the uh, pool, spa, gym, and so on. And the uh, the club uh, club uh, room is on the top floor, 16. by the club suite. So uh, we'll go up to the club room later. Yeah, there's a water features on the uh, on the floor. I'm not sure why they didn't give me a top floor room to be honest. Yeah, it's a water feature. Yeah. It's uh, Friday. Staycations are very busy because of uh, coronavirus lockdowns. Like people in Singapore, like yeah. So uh, staycations are busy. Yeah, it's looking out to it. Yeah, some local housing it's there. Yeah, it's the walkway into the uh, 
Hollywood is open air, it's a hotel in a garden complex, yeah? That's what it is. CBD, Singapore CBD is just uh, straight ahead. Country is pretty much 99% uh, open except nightclubs and uh, the airport. So we're into November of uh, 2020. Yeah. Walk into my suite. Check my pockets, I've got my key card. Yeah, it's quite in from the, uh, the lift lobby. There's a nice uh, water feature and so on, yeah. Get a bit of uh, Singapore, yeah? Okay, walk you in. So it's all air conditioned this bit. That bit was like open air. So my room is at the front there. So I get like uh, Marina Bay views. Yeah, so that's the pool and the street. I have a Pickering Street down there. It's the pool and stuff. And now you get the gardens. The gardens are only accessible on level 5 where the, uh, the pool is. Down there. Don't worry, I'll, uh, I'll take you around the whole place, yeah? It's a three day, two night staycation. This is actually day two, so I've already been in the pool and all that, but I'll show you the room uh, on day two. The circumstances. So, hey, so I'm in 1038, it's a junior suite. It's your key card here. Key card to Mr. K at 1038. So, you tap. And uh, we'll come in. Number 1038. So, we're into November, it's November 14, like that. I've got Turkish Formula 1 on the box, it's the uh, it's your living room, it's Turkey Formula 1 on the box, if you're lucky you'll see Lewis Hamilton. And there's the bedroom, and there you got some pretty good views of uh, SG out of the window, it's the Hong Lim Park, Singapore Speaker's Corner, got towards Clark Key, see Singapore's parliament uh, where the flag is on Boat Key. Hey, so welcome to my uh, junior suite here at uh, Park Royal Pickering. Got the Singapore Parliament straight ahead. You can see a bit of the Formula One circuit and uh, speakers corner down there. So I'll speak around the uh, speak around my uh, junior suite. Yeah, here's the bedroom like this, and uh, you get the bathroom. Sports fans, sports fans, greetings, uh, boys and girls. Welcome in. Welcome to the uh, Park Royal Hotel, uh, Singapore. Sports fans, boys and girls, stay safe through coronavirus. The bathroom. All right, I forgot that out. That is uh, going to be one of the most unique greetings on the planet, right? Right up there with Donald Trump's uh, Make America Great Again. The Biden one. Yeah, so this is the living room. Got some food, nasty going on the table. All right, let's start. Uh, let's see entrance in, yeah? Yeah, so let's start with the food. Uh, the service is ex exceptional in this hotel, yeah? That's one of the few places when you order a nasty going room service, they actually give you free mango juice. Here at uh, Park Royal Pickering. Alrighty. Let's get free mango juice to go with the nasi goreng. It's nasi goreng, you've seen that before, I'm not going to describe it to you. Uh, watching Formula One out of Turkey. Oh, right, uh, where was it? Where are we going to Turkey? Raffles, Four Seasons, and uh, Shangri La at the Bosphorus, yeah? Yeah, Turkish Formula One. How oh, I miss getting on an airplane and travelling. I'm sure that sentiment is mutual. Alright, let's go put out the window, alright? Staycations. Alright, so let's start. Yeah, the red boys are here. Okay, let's start. Uh, there's the minibars in there. Uh, it's empty. They're trying to maximize social interaction through uh, coronavirus lockdowns. The tea is TWG. Alright, so it's not still on tea. It's TWG. It's alright. One hold against them. So it's a club junior suite, so I'll, ship, I'll take you up to the club room later at uh, Park Royal. See all these club facilities. Uh, evening cocktails at 6 o'clock. So we've got there for six o'clock evening cocktails. Nice club uh, thing. It's a nice cube. At uh, Park Royal Pickering. I know what that's for actually. Alright, so that's where we are. At uh, Park Royal Pickering. So Hong Lim Park is just across the way. If you stay here during Formula One, you will not get... It's a good hotel to stay, but you will not get the circuit views. Uh, the F1 circuit is around the Marina Bay, you see this? So MBS, Swiss Hotel, Mandan Oriental, Ritz Carlton, all those are the best ones to stay. It's a good place to stay. It's Mandan Oriental. So we're in the CBD area, Chinatown, uh, in the CBD. 
It says G. And the world. Paddy Earth, yep, that's where we are. Here it's uh, Park Royal Pickering. Yeah, so it's junior suits, you get like a, a living room area like this. And then the bedroom is through here, to the bedroom. Some of the rooms don't have like 180 degree views. And I'll talk you off the bathroom. This bathroom, don't have sports fan stuff, so this is your bathroom. Fairly standard uh, bathroom in a five star hotel. Here's sinks and yeah, some of my gear there, toothpaste, toothbrush, soap, all that stuff. And then just from the bathtub, you can actually, you're standing in the bathtub, how's it getting? It's on holiday. Boys and girls, welcome, <laughs> that's SG. So these are gardens, hotels, it's like garden there, uh, hotel or garden. It's in like Bali, yeah? Yeah, it's the roof of the hotel, it's up there. It's my floor is garden, you can't actually walk onto that garden. The, on level five you can, that's where the pool is. You'll see that in the bedroom. That's where the pool is, yeah. It's plants and stuff. It's greenery. The hotel is good, right? Okay. Yeah. Pretty good bathroom. Decided to stay here for a week. Staying here for three days, two nights. Because yeah, I live nearby, boys and girls. Yeah, Mercedes on TV. Buckle up, pickling. What's happening there? Max is, Max is uh, P1. This is P1 on. Uh, Okay, so you get store area. I brought my Formula One gear. It's a Singapore uh, Formula One shirt from uh, year 2017. I'll wear that later sometime. That yeah, Formula One t-shirt from Singapore. That's for the swimming pool. Park Royal Pickering. Yep, you get a bathroom, a wardrobe like that. For your gear. And uh, not a bad uh, bedroom. Right, let me talk you about the windows in the place. So what do we have out of here? So this is the pool area, so you can see the hotel uh, goes all the way up there. I thought it was going to be a high floor, I thought it was going to be a top floor room because I booked an urban, I booked a uh, junior suite, a club junior suite. You know, they gave me one level 10. Like I said, it's busy. Uh, you've heard of Singapore Islands and Changi Airport, so staycations are very busy. Uh, yeah, doesn't matter. Most people that stay in this hotel, it's actually, the pricing is actually not very expensive, this hotel. Yeah, okay. Enough said. Right, out of the window. So that's looking uh, northwards towards uh, beyond Clark Key. So we've stayed at the uh, Swiss Hotel Stanford, the Swiss Hotel Stanford just there. Stay at the Shrine right Clark Key. And then right up in the distance, you can see where you see the Singtel, the Singtel uh, building there. I've ordered my iPhone 12, by the way, iPhone Pro Max 12. Takes two weeks to deliver. Wait, that's Orchard Road, yeah, that's where the Singtel building is, that's Orchard Road. Yeah. It's uh, downtown SG, SG Core. Clark Key, where the uh, Swiss Hotel is. Just in the foreground. And the Hong Lim Park, we'll go out there for a walk. And then uh, out of this window. Yes, yeah, so that's Hong Lim Park. You see the street down below, there's cars down there, yeah? It's Upper Pickering Street. Yeah, Singapore Speaker's Corner. You still have to lodge with the police before you, you can't just go there and start talking. Like, you know my YouTube videos where I just go around random places and just start talking. You still have to uh, register with the police here and uh, as far as I'm aware before you start uh, giving speeches to the local people or anybody else who happens to be in Singapore as a tourist or otherwise. And then uh, just beyond there, you've got the Singapore Parliament and the Law Courts. So uh, that's the uh, Singapore Parliament just there. Singapore Parliament and then the, the Law Courts are uh, next to us. It's a great place, yeah. We got through coronavirus so safely in this country, yeah. The best place in the world uh, for coronavirus. Uh, this place is going around lockdown and stuff, yeah. So Mr. K is enjoying SG. Yeah, very much so. I'll uh, walk into the living room and give you a proper talk out the window. It's 
Stop being funny as well, right? Very food, nasi goreng. You forgot that, right? Your mind is still fizzing. All right, red boy number two. All right, we'll just start this in there. So we'll start with the. Uh, yeah, we'll just put the camera on the Singapore Parliament. It's just there. So on that frame, you see the Singapore Parliament, the foreground, the law courts. Just beyond is the Padang. So that's actually on the Formula One circuit. And then just beyond, you'll see the uh, Swiss Hotel, JW Marriott, Esplanades. Uh, and so on. Sort of boat key, boat key area. And then just panning around, there's another hotel that I want to stay at, which is the uh, the Fort Canning Hotel, which is the greenery just there that you see. See that greenery? It's the Fort Canning Hotel on that hill. Those of you that can remember 15 years ago, there was a, a music band called uh, Scissor Sisters. I don't feel like dancing, no sir, no dancing today. Yeah, that band, yes, yeah, sisters. I saw them before. I saw them uh, at Fort Canning. Uh, then a long time ago, yeah. It's a blast from the past. Yeah, so let's see you from the room. We'll see the place at night. Oh, Clarkie and uh, Hongling Park Impact, and so on. You see, generally married in the distance, yeah. Right, so see you from the room. Um, I'll eat my food and uh, watch a bit of uh, F1 out of uh, Turkey. So we'll sh we shall see you. Uh, yeah, I'm going to uh, go down to the pool. I'll just add, add bits on as uh, just add bits on as we go through the stay. Uh, the swimming pool, club lounge. We'll go to the club lounge next. Uh, pool, club lounge, just everything, yeah. Um, the world is far more understanding through uh, COVID lockdowns uh, in general terms than before, so... Uh, I know that reading the comments on YouTube. Uh, so we'll just, uh, yeah, play by ear, alright? So we'll see you uh, at the club lounge next and then on from there, alright? Got the uh, the club lounge for uh, evening uh, cocktails. See what the lift looks like here. Get my key card. Mm -hmm. Club lounge is on uh, level 16. Sorry. We're on now level 10. There's the guest rooms, the pool and stuff is on level 5. Lobby and stuff like that. 15. Sports fans. Sorry, 15. They mask, right? Seen the uh, the lift here at uh, Park Royal Pickering Club Lounge for uh, afternoon cocktails. We've got an outdoor terrace as well. Just out there and uh, right. that's inside. I'll get my food and then I'll show you the place, alright? So we've uh, come to the, uh, the club lounge for uh, evening uh, cocktails. Just a quick glass of wine and uh, some bites there. It's the view out the window. It's a pretty good views up here. The views are better up here than, uh, than uh, downstairs in the room. See boat key. Padang, all the Marina Bay area. Looking across this tree, they've got an outdoor terrace. Got an outdoor terrace which I'll uh, walk you on to. Yeah, it's Club Lounge here, it's pretty good. It's a uh, Park Royal. Got a nice Club Lounge actually. Looks Slippers, it's fell off. Yeah, it's quite a nice club lounge. The food over there, and uh, yeah, that's what I'm having. Get these bites. 
and a glass of wine. Sauvignon Blanc. Some uh, not bad views of uh, SG. All right, take you on the terrace in a second. So we just uh, walked out onto the uh, the terrace at the roof of the uh, Park Royal Hotel. Yeah, the club lounge uh, just in through there. Yeah, they have a, a rooftop terrace. Uh, it's a pretty good uh, glass of wine there, actually. Uh, with the, uh, there's uh, cheese and biscuits. Yeah, it's the terrace at the uh, top of the uh, Park Royal. Just digesting the food. Yeah, so you get some pretty good views of uh, SG. Well, this side, which you've seen many times before, uh, and more interestingly, uh, the side that looks uh, towards the uh, the port, in the south of the island. Uh, there aren't so many hotels that we haven't seen so many times before. Ready? So welcome to the uh, the terrace at the roof of the uh, Park Royal Pickering. Just having my uh, evening cocktails there. And uh, yeah, this place has uh, some pretty good views of uh, SG. As you can see the Marina Bay area. I keep uh, repeating myself. Uh, see the Padang, there's people playing a sport on the field. But uh, Singapore Cricket Club and the Singapore Recreation Club, they play cricket and uh, hockey and football and tennis and so on. There's the foreground, you see the river, Singapore River that flows past uh, Boat Key. All those uh, sort of shop houses, their bars and restaurants, and uh, get Sri Lankan chili crab at some of the restaurants. There, single parliament and foreground, the law courts, and all the uh, five star hotels at Marina Bay, Formula One circuit is. Uh, so, the other side, this Garden Hotel. Alrighty, this side will be more interesting for you guys because uh, there's no, there aren't much in the way of hotels around here. Sentosa is too far to see. So this side is a bit more interesting. Uh, looking out towards more suburban, and residential. Um, yeah, so that's Singapore's uh, highest building there. If I'm not mistaken. It's the Guoko Tower at Tanjung Paga. It's the foreground. So the CBD opening out. It's down there. Skyscrapers and uh, so on. Yeah, life is pretty much back to normal domestically in Singapore after coronavirus uh, 2020. Uh, nightclubs are still closed and like stuff like the airport and stuff, but mostly back to normal. You can see Centos are out in the distance. You can see the cable cars that we took. Uh, right there, down the distance of Centos. There's cable cars going out to Centos. Yeah. Pretty good at uh, this time of day. Only part of the world. Some residences, apartments, people's apartments. And it's like Singapore Port. It's not there. It's on. Ready, right, just the view. Okay, but, uh, park around the door, I didn't close properly. Ah, so we'll go this way a bit. Let's see. Pretty good, right? On the roof of the hotel. At sunset. Alrighty, see you back in the room. Some night views out of the uh, junior suite. Nice up here. Thanks to all of you that recommended the place. Yeah, I'm actually, uh, it's actually, it is actually a very nice place. I wouldn't have stayed here today if, you, if it wasn't recommended. I'd have stayed at W Sentosa or Men Oriental. So it's a team effort on social media. 
All right, let's keep talking. It's in the room. Night news over dinner. Just come down to uh, Hong Lim Park uh, for an early evening uh, walk. Uh, I'll take you onto the bridge. Uh, see uh, people out and about. I'll take you onto the bridge above uh, Clark Key. You can see a bit of Chinatown in the city. Uh, so you can see the hotel nicely there. There's the uh, all the gardens and the cabanas. I'm going for my evening swim in a bit. So uh, just come out for a walk at uh, Hong Lim Park. Looks nice that one. Uh, Clark Key uh, subway station. So on a bridge, uh, get on the bridge and uh, have a look. All right, it's going up my uh, a walk for my swim. CBD hotel behind the trees. I right, see you on the bridge. So we've uh, come on to the uh, the bridge above uh, Clark Key station. See the hotel there. Uh, looking up towards uh, Chinatown in this direction, it's the Farama Hotel, it's uh, Yutong Sen Street, it's all the way down there. Chinatown's all down there. That's the bridge. See, like a Chinese temple there. So, I see a Swiss hotel, it's at Clark Key Central there. Looking towards uh, Clark Key and uh, yeah, all that area down there. Chimes is further up. Uh, Singapore in the evening. See the city there. Life, real life. Place is uh, pretty much open after coronavirus. So we're in uh, we're in uh, October, November now. November even November of uh, 2020. Yep. Back to the hotel for my uh, evening swim. All right. So we're uh, back in the gardens of the uh, Park Royal. Uh, come for my uh, early evening swim. Gardens there again. Dusk is falling. Just uh, standing in one of the cabanas there. It's yeah, half past six in the evening. Uh, lovely evening here in Singapore. So. Uh, Come down for my uh, swim here, swim in the uh, in the pool. So I'll uh, take you in and uh, get our feet wet. In the Garden Hotel. Ah, uh, see in the water. Come uh, poolside here, poolside at the uh, park row. I'll take you in the water for a, for a dip. Just navigate our way past uh, these people. There's a few uh, people that get our way past, yeah? For a second. Just gym through there. Alrighty, it's the pool. Pool to ourselves. 6.30 in the evening. Ah, yeah. Not bad, this guy gets you in. This is lucky, all right? There were a uh, few people in here. Got it to ourselves. It's the infinity pool here at uh, Park Royal. Cabanas. See the gardens up there. It's also the water, man. Yeah, in the pool. We'll come again here in the morning when there's nobody here, I'll talk you around. Guys, uh, cleaning the water there. It's good. It's Hongling Park. In the pool with Mr. K. We're lucky, yeah. Nobody in the water. This is good. 
There's some people in here that just got out just as I was getting in. Uh, the gardens, Bali, Ayung River. Like this. I'll come back tomorrow morning, but uh, the spa is straight ahead. And uh, it's the gym just through there. Alright. That's the place. That's true, you can see the city. See the city, uh, you start there. Swiss Hotel, Marina Bay, where the Formula One circuit is. Mandarin Oriental, Ritz Carlton, all that start there. All right, for now, that's a quick uh, get me wet in the pool. On evening. There's the gardens. Uh, see you in the room for uh, dinner. Uh, that's good. We've uh, come to the garden on the evening. The views are uh, pretty amazing of, uh, of uh, Singapore uh, from the, uh, the Park Royal. They have a garden walk which I'll uh, take you on in a second. These are the, uh, the cabanas. Place in the evening. The room's all the way up there. Funny. I'll take you on the garden walk. It's 300 meter garden walk. Uh, I'll take you on about 100 meters of it because uh, you don't see everything. Anyway, place in the evening. the skyline of uh, S3 in the distance. The garden walk is basically just down there. It's that path down there that you see. It's the garden walk. Uh, part of it's obscured by the... Uh, we've got some plants and stuff. Part of the view rather is obscured. Pretty good. See the skyline of the CBD just over there. And the herbs for dinner later. Turkey uh, Formula One on. The uh, pool is straight ahead. See the SG down there. And the water features. The garden walk is uh, just on the right. Uh, the views are as good as up here. You can take your pick uh, which you prefer. Alrighty, take you down for the uh, the garden walk. Alright, this bit's good. We get to the pool this side. Okay, as opposed to uh, through the security there. Safe entry and stuff. Alright, so there is the garden walk. See the sign. How do you say that in French? Just go down these stairs. Flip flops. I get better view from the pool. We've got like plants and stuff here. Yellow cane palm. Uh, the, the, the shrubs obscure the view over there. So you see it better from uh, under the pool. The pool is here on the left. More of the hotel. Bali. When can we go to Bali? Singapore is opening up a travel bubble with Hong Kong on uh, November the 22nd. It's in a week's time, but it's still a bit restricted. I'm not going so soon. All right, let's see you in the evening. That's the pool behind us, yeah? So what do we see? You can see all of Marina Bay. It's too far to watch Formula One from here, but you can certainly see, uh, all right, what do we know down there? Where have we not stayed down there? So that's the Ritz Carlton first up on the right. Mandarin Oriental, uh, Marine, Park Royal Marina Mandarin just there, 
Conrad State, bringing around the Swiss Hotel, JW Marriott, and as yeah, tell all of them pretty much. Tumbling Park. Singapore's a speaker's corner. There's Clark here on this side. Yeah, pretty good views, eh? The pool is just there, uh, yeah. Swim pool. So I was earlier. Nice in the pool. So up under this cabana, there's the one there, there's two pools actually, two little ones. And there's one between. Yep. More the same. Ready. So I'm gonna get some uh, photographs. I'm gonna get some photographs for uh, Instagram. See you up in the room for uh, food, dinner. All right. Bit of a Turkish Formula One. See you up in the room. So uh, welcome to the uh, the junior suite uh, in the evening. The suite in the evening. We've got uh, in-room dinner and. Uh, Night time in uh, SG. It's the place. It's the place and the uh, nice shower in there earlier. The bathroom. And uh, all the blinds and the curtains are open. Bedroom, so you get uh, decent views of uh, SG out of the window. Got uh, Formula One on the box uh, over dinner. Just happening there. Looking at uh, Kvyat. Yeah, this place at night. <clears throat> Stay in the place. Uh, so you'll get, and you'll get some uh, pretty decent views of uh, SG out of the window. Just like that. SG at night out the window. Show the view on this side. Uh, yeah, it's a busy city, yeah? Six million people. You see the cars on the streets. All the lights there. Functioning city of uh, six million people. There's no uh, no lockdowns here at the moment. Through all that, and uh, it's the hotel, gardens and stuff. Uh, the lights on. Make the most of uh, coronavirus lockdowns. The airport closed. Yeah, just see out the window. In my. Uh, My sweet, junior sweet. So uh, I've got dinner there. And also turkey formula one. So dinner is uh, it's a bit of uh, pancakes and Hainanese chicken rice. I've gone for a, uh, an odd mix, shall we say, breakfast and dinner all in one. Straight out the window and then, uh, yeah, you can see the city out there, yeah? It's a street down below. Down below. Yeah, Fort Canning. Down towards the uh, Singapore Parliament and the such. Out right there. Alrighty. So, what is Mr. K having for dinner as he watches Turkey Formula One where he went on a Rolls Royce in the Shangri La Hotel last year? So, we've gone for a good mix of uh, Hainanese chicken rice. This is Hainanese chicken rice. That's the rice bit, and then that's the uh, the chicken bit. There's some chicken and some tomatoes and stuff. You just eat the chicken, yeah. I try and avoid salads in hotels. Uh, just general terms, uh, yeah. High only chicken rice, and uh, as you saw the mini bar earlier, it wasn't very well stocked. So I also got some pancakes. That's my two o'clock in the morning food when I feel a bit hungry. Pancakes for uh, pancakes and syrup and stuff like that for a bit later. So yeah, so that's dinner. 
Hainanese chicken rice and pancakes. That's the mango juice from earlier, which I haven't touched because I'm on the boys' stuff here. It's a bit of uh, spirits and coke. It's lovely when the hotels bring you a can of Diet Coke here with dinner, yeah? It's one of those kind of places, yeah? It's not the Four Seasons or it's Carlton. Uh, it's not youthos either, but uh, yeah, they bring you stuff like that. So watch uh, Formula One on the box. My dinner here. Singapore Formula One has cancelled this year, wearing the shirt, Singapore Formula One shirt. Uh, we'll go to the real thing now, rather than watching it on TV in due course. Alright, it's the place. Dinner for Mr. K, alright. Let's go up to the, uh, the club lounge, see what it looks like up there through open air. I think, uh, I'll see up in the club lounge in a bit after I eat the food. Show the views through open air at night, properly at night, alright. A slow star. So just uh, come up to the uh, the rooftop again. This time at uh, night. Rooftop at the uh, the Park Royal. So you'll see the uh, the lovely city of uh, Singapore. Mr. K calls home. Uh, Singapore's uh, highest building and uh, all the CBD area. You don't see this from many of the uh, the five-star hotels at the Marina Bay area because they just face the uh, the bay. But at uh, Park Royal uh, Pickering, see Singapore's highest building. You'll see the port and uh, Sentosa way out in the distance. Out there, and then uh, as we walk over to uh, this side, this side you've all seen before many times on uh, my videos. That's the club lounge just in there. Yeah, get a club room if you stay here. Get a club room. It's about seventy dollars more expensive than here. Just get a club room. All right, you'll see all. You'll get this. Uh, so yeah, it's this downtown SG. Stuff down there, Hongling Park, and the place. Local time is about nine o'clock in the evening, and uh, very nice indeed. Downtown SG at night, lovely. The palm trees uh, are in the tropics, yeah? Swaying in the wind. Lovely evening. Lovely evening and uh, full of day. Uh, Park Royal Pickering. So see in the morning, uh, we'll go for a morning swim, I think based on uh, what time I wake up. I'm watching Formula One in the room. Uh, based on what time I wake up, maybe get a bit of breakfast in. Morning swim and uh, that will be the stay, pretty much. Yeah, I think we've seen most of uh, Park Royal Pickering. Where would I stay in Singapore? What, what are the choices? Uh, through these coronavirus lockdowns, uh, just watch the sequence that I've made the videos at, which has been Raffles, Four Seasons, MBS, Capella, here. A bit with uh, social media advice that pretty much sums up uh, hotels in Singapore, yeah? Yeah, downtown SG. Cannot go wrong. Superbly run place. See you in the morning. Just uh, come downstairs for uh, for breakfast. Breakfast uh, I could have in the uh, in the club lounge upstairs. They have a champagne breakfast. Uh, most of the time in these hotels, uh, the breakfast in the main restaurant has a better choice, albeit uh, non-champagne, albeit without champagne. So uh, yeah, I could have had breakfast in the club lounge upstairs. 
we were gonna have breakfast in the main restaurant down here which is also you get to see the restaurant right uh which is lime all right it's the main hotel uh, restaurant inside for a bit of brekkie. So Lime is the uh, the restaurant here for uh, breakfast, lunch and dinner. Just come down for breakfast. Breakfast uh, just do there. There's a few other people uh, down for breakfast so uh, Let's navigate our way past and see outdoor uh, area. Mr. K is uh, sitting just over here. That's the restaurant. Yeah, that's my breakfast. Gone for... Uh, uh, they didn't have eggs benedict here, so uh, gone for that kind of egg. Some bacon and uh, baked beans. We've got some uh, pancakes. I had pancakes last night, remember? It's quite nice, so uh, I've gone for some more at breakfast. The simple principle of uh, stick with what you like and a coffee. Breakfast, Mr. K. Here at Lime. Right, if you enjoy my breakfast, uh, I might go in the pool. We'll see how. Uh, and then it's Saturday today, alright? Breakfast at Lime. Alrighty, so we've come uh, poolside uh, after breakfast. See the uh, city waking up. Uh, there's uh, people in the uh, in the main swimming pool, so we'll uh, we'll confine ourselves to the little one just here. So this is the spa. It's the spa here. Of course, St Gregory's Spa, uh, and the gym is just through there. Mr. K is parked. Just here, about Royal Pickering. All right, get in the water. There's people on the other side here. It's 7, 7.30 in the morning, and there's uh, people in the main pool. So, uh, get in the little pool. Get our feet wet. Okay, we'll uh, get our feet wet for the morning. We went in the other pool uh, a couple of nights ago. That's uh, the garden walk. We went in the other pool a couple of nights ago, so we'll uh, go in the little one. That's the gardens up there. That's the just over there. This one's a little pool. At least we got our feet wet. All right, very good morning to you all, and happy Diwali. It's Diwali today. Where in the world you are. Alrighty, that's pretty much our tour of the uh, Park Royal Pickering. So we're uh, back up in the uh, junior suite after uh, swimming the pool and uh, breakfast this morning. An enjoyable stay at uh, Park Royal Pickering. I uh, got the first part of the uh, the Turkey Formula One in. Go home now and uh, watch the race and qualifying and so on. Yep, so junior suite, some great views of uh, Singapore, both from the room and uh, uh, the terrace at the club lounge upstairs. Convenient location for the hotel. And uh, enjoyable stay. Lovely day in Singapore this morning. Thanks, guys, and uh, yeah. Brought me a uh, welcome, uh, welcome cake for the morning. Yeah, this place after we've uh, finished with the stay. Now, thank you to all of those of you that uh, recommended uh, adding this to my uh, collection of uh, hotels to stay at. Sports fans, greetings. All right, so where are we going next? The Red Boys are packed. Red boys are packed and uh, ready to go. Uh, the next travels will be, uh, we'll be actually leaving Singapore. 
albeit uh, it's a cruise from nowhere in uh, two weeks. Cruise from nowhere, Royal Caribbean. Uh, basically two days, uh, two nights out at sea. Uh, depart and uh, return to Singapore. We will hit international uh, international waters at uh, Hong Lim Park. Yeah, so that's the plan. That's the next. Uh, it's Mr. K's uh, next uh, travel and uh, YouTube video, shall we say? All right, cruise nowhere, Royal Caribbean cruise, big ship. Uh, I've seen the boat already. It's parked uh, harbour side. Yeah, Park Royal Pickering, nice hotel. Enjoyed the stay. All right, we'll see you on the boat in uh, two weeks' time. Nice gardens as well. Get a club room when you stay here. Yeah. Views at the top of the best. Alright, ciao.